He stole up on the beat and Fifi on the track. I'm showing you the ball spot that's where it's at. No, <laughs> let me stop playing. Now, nah, for real though, y'all see this ball spot. Okay, I do want to bust a flow, but that ain't what this is about. I just want to show you a technique called ventilating. And I will use this um, balding area here to show you how to repair a balding frontal or closure that's the side view there and what I'm gonna do here is um, section this little piece off here I want to grab me about two to three inches of this area and I am just going to just cut that off just like that so that I can have this hair the same texture to repair that balding spot because this is a very old wig I don't have any bundles and this wig was purchased a long time ago so I wouldn't have any of the bundles to repair it and um, I'm just gonna do this just so that it can have the same texture of hair and I don't know how much I'll need so I'm taking a second piece about the same length about two to three um, inches long and once I do this I am going to separate the different lengths that is um, in this but well it's not actually a bundle being that I'm cutting it but I'm going to separate the lengths that is out of this portion of the track um, usually you have a ratio of lengths inside of um, a track giving you the whole um, weight of the length of the bundle or the wig this is what I mean okay if you don't understand what I'm trying to explain so I went ahead and separated all the lens out of that those pieces of hairs that I cut off and this is me ventilating I am ventilating using um, a magnifying light that really really helps because the lace holes are very small and so you want something that will allow you to be able to see those holes easily. I am using a technique that is just a single knot technique. And this is just a um, view of my progress. Um, I was grabbing one strand with each hole. Every now and then I would accidentally get two to three strands. And I continue to do it that way because this is a very old wig. And I just really want to fill the wig in for demonstration purposes to let you see that you don't have to throw away um, an old wig that you may like or one that you've really invested um, some really good moolah in so um here we go this is it it is repaired it looks 1000 percent better than what we saw previously with those big ball spots up there and so um like i said this is um, a technique called ventilating and i used a single knot um the single knotting te technique and so this is just to show you that you do not have to throw away an old wig. You can always just um, learn this technique, put it in your archives, especially if you deal with a lot of wig making or if you want to make your own wigs. This is something that you must know and you must have. It is um, a bit tedious, but it is so rewarding. And it's not as bad as it seems. Once you kind of get the hang of what it is that you're trying to achieve, then it's like anything else. Thank you.